Welcome back to Couponing with Kayla. Today we're shopping at Ross and Michael's. So they have this little spa set for like $4.99. So pretty cheap on that. Um, they've got different little makeup brush sets here. Um, marked down pretty cheap. Um, I'm over here looking for the 49 cent items that they said um, that they're going to have or that I heard they were going to have. Um, so I'm kind of just grabbing a few things. This one was $3.99. I found this shirt for $2.49 these brushes 249 um i found these little soaps and they actually are 49 cents so i did find um a couple of items so far over here some of them still 249 some are 49 cents but um some are open these just 99 cents for these little elf slippers then some more makeup these are 349 um some of them were not marked down, just regular price. So I was kind of just um, looking through here, seeing if I could find anything that was super cheap. These right here said like $1.49. Um, then I was looking to see um, several things say like $3.49 or $2.49, um, things like that. So I'm looking to see here... Um, this one it's missing a piece and it's um 2.99 so a little more than the small set that one's regular so this one is still 8.99 but we got those cheaper at walgreens the other day these um little tumblers they were 2.49 so i was hoping that some things would be cheaper but i'm not sure when they make the jump to the 49 cent this is my first time shopping at ross so like this i thought um was going to be cheaper but nope it's $6.99 so I don't know I'm looking at Christmassy stuff but some of it is not marked down at all some of it is there's a few toy items I saw um this is 49 cents another 49 cent item so i'm looking over here at books these are christmas books um and they're not 49 cents but they are marked down um to cheaper so i guess these items will go to 49 cent at some point but um yeah right now i'm just looking for the little tags that are the clearance tags that have that little pink part on them um a lot of these things are still regular priced items so several of these are marked down to $8.49. That's pretty cheap for those frozen um, ball pit type things. So yeah, um, there's a few items marked down over here with the frozen stuff, just not a lot. Okay, here's another 49 cent item, but some of these over here um, are not marked 49 cents, but they look very similar, but they're still like $1.49 or um, $2.49, things like that. So definitely check to see if it is 49 cents. So I'm over here in the kids clothing now. Um, these are cute, only 99 cents, very soft. Some slippers, pretty cheap. They got these too. So I'm looking right over here. Um, I thought some of these Christmas ones would be marked down. Oh, that is a really cheap dress right there. Very cute. That's too small for my daughter, but um, also she might not be into that. But <laughs> um, yeah, see this you would think would be cheaper, but. Okay, so these, oh my gosh, they're like little flask or whatever. They're 49 cents. Um, these are little M&M fans. Um, these still say $1.49, but they're clearly Christmas, so I would think that they would be marked down um, to less. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, 49 okay, so cents. I went to Ross for their 49 cent sale, so your store may be doing it, maybe not, so just remember it varies by location. Today is January 28th. I went and I picked up this shirt for only $3.99, this one for only $2.49. I picked up these little flasks. I thought this was pretty funny. And these were only 49 cents. That's so funny. Literally. <laughs> There's a bunch of them in here. All the different colors. Oh God, this desktop basketball for 49 cents. A mini poker set. 49 cents. Fans. 
49 cents. Um, flippers. 99 cents. Cute comfy pants for just 99 cents. I spent $16.90 and six of that was a Jurassic World toy for my son. So the rest was only about 10 bucks for all of this. Okay guys, so I went to Michael's this morning for the $4 bags. Um, this started yesterday in one store near me. They were completely sold out today. I called before I went. They said they didn't have any more boxes or bags. Then I called another store and they said they did have some. So I went ahead and what it is, they have these bags for $4 and you don't know what's inside of them. They also have smaller bags um, in some stores. This is the only bags they had in my stores, like big garbage bags. So you pay four bucks, you don't know what's inside. Some people get boxes. It was already ripped so I could see a little in it and I went ahead and picked it up because I could see this. So I'm gonna open it all up and lay it out and then see what we got. So I just emptied out the first bag and it had this for like a little marquee sign. It's like really kind of cool because it lights up and all of that. So that is pretty cool. Um, got one of those. I got this cake plate. It's normally like $20. Um, a box of candy canes. This cute um, little table decor. It looks more like an Easter item. I don't really know, but um, that's cute. Bag of balloons. I would never pay $5 for a bag of balloons, but yeah. I don't know. They say something on it. Oh, it's like, it says, Welcome, baby boy. So, yeah, so if you need something like that, so random things. I got two of these tins, so those are kind of cute. They are the big tins, they are normally $5 each. I got this, I thought this was really cute. It lights up, so those are normally 12 bucks. I got this little gingerbread mansion so the kids can build this next year. It's pretty cool. Normally $20. So that is everything for my first bag. So probably about 50 something dollars worth of stuff for four bucks. Second bag, and this is what was in this one. So I got another tin, one of those big tins. Got another thing of candy canes. Got some nice Christmas cards, normally 15 bucks. I definitely wouldn't pay $15 for cards, so that's cool. Um, so, in the other one, I got the baby boy balloons. This one, I got a baby boy banner. So, if I end up being around anybody who's having a baby boy, I'll be doing good. Um, so, there's that. I got this craft paper, which is really pretty. I got two big pads of this. Um, so, I don't know what the price is normally on these. It doesn't say but this paper is so cute it's like all like pink kind of designs but really cute i don't even know like what all oh i don't even know what all i'm gonna use this for oh it's so cute but um anyways oh that is so cute i don't know i'll make something out of it right um so oh and then i got another jar but this one's blue that's pretty. I got some earmuffs. My son would look cute in these. And those are normally, I don't know, $4.99. So then I got this little, what is it, like a tent or whatever. It's kind of like odd shape, maybe for like the garden or something. I don't know. But it's kind of cute. And then it had all these things in it. So... Autumn Walk, and these are normally $4 each, the little wax melts. I do have one of those things that does for wax melts, so if these smell good, then I've, I've got four of them. So anyway, so that is all the stuff from bag number two. Hey guys, so this is bag number three. So a few repeat items, but I saw one item that I am really excited about. So more candy canes, another tin like that that I got over in that one. Another one of the little bunny things that I got over here. <laughs> I got more wax melts, but this one is cinnamon spice. Smells pretty good. I got another box of the cards. It's plenty of Christmas cards. I got this um, thing of paper, but this one is different than me than my other one. And it's a red and green one. So, ooh. oh, really cute. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, it's like hard to. Oh, cute. 
Oh, yeah, I like this. <laughs> Can you make, like, cards out of this? I don't even know, you guys. Like, I'm, I'm just going to make something out of it. I don't even know. But, so, there is that. Oh, that's cute. Okay, so some super cute paper. A little countdown going on. Okay, I got some cookie cutters. I got another one of these, which I'm not complaining because these jars are cute. I think my daughter will like these. So I got another yellow one. So I have two yellow ones and a blue one, or two gold and a blue, whatever. And then I got this, which I really like. Check this out. It's in those little um, LED candles with the remote. And this is normally 30 bucks right here. So, and see, it's like the candle fades and all of that. My mom got me something like this like a while back, like a couple years ago. So I have like a set that's similar to this. But so I'm excited. This is like really nice. I like it. So, this is everything that I got in my three bags. So for $12, I got all of this. So, not not too shabby. Not too shabby. I'm I'm not complaining. Um, definitely some good stuff. Some stuff I might um, give away. Other things I'll keep. Um, so I feel pretty good about it overall. Um, nothing that was like weird or like junk or anything. So I didn't get any like Christmas ornaments or anything or any Christmas signs. I would have liked that. Uh, but I'm happy with the stuff that I got for sure. So. And I'll add up and see how much these are good until 2021. So that's not bad. So, hey, I got candy canes for next year. I mean, for this coming Christmas and the next one after that. Well, practically November, whatever. So I <laughs> got plenty um, of that. So, yeah, that's everything I got. So definitely not um, complaining about that. I'm going to add everything up and see what a value I got for $12. Okay, so everything that I got was a total value of about $315, and I got all of this for $12, so literally like a $300 savings, and this is 32 items, so after I added up 32 items for $12, that's like $0.37 cents an item, so I would definitely say that all of these items are worth $0.37 cents or more each for sure, so... That is everything that I got today, so happy shopping. If there's some bags left at your store, go ahead and grab them.